Right, guys, what have we here? A running back, no less. Joe Mixon, number 38 on the list of the top 100 NFL players in 2022. Now, I mentioned this in the previous video. Joe Mixon is a name that's come across my screen, well, actually, to be honest, not many times. But once I've actually started uh, getting back into the league after my four-month or five-month off-season hiatus, there is a name that's always thrown around, especially in that top five running back um, graphic or story or news article. And it's Joe Mixon. It's Joe Mixon, he plays for the Bengals, and clearly he must have had a fairly decent season last year, being that they did make, make the Super Bowl. I'm sure that he was a pretty decent part of that journey. I don't really, I don't know much about him. I, I can't put a face to the name, but being that he is in the top 40, being that he is a running back, uh, I reckon we start this video off looking at some stats. So let's do that. Nick Minnett. Joseph Tyler Mixon, born July 24th, 1996. He's 26 years of age, 6 foot 1, 220 pounds. Okay. Oklahoma from 14 to 16, got picked up in the second round of the 2017 draft with pick number 48. Been at the Bengals ever since. Finally made a Pro Bowl in 2021. 445 for the 40 yard dash. He is quick. 35 inches in the vertical, 9 foot 10 on the board jump, 21 reps on the bench. And a 12 in the wonder look. Um, all right, so he's an athlete. Absolutely explosive, strong, tall. He's played five seasons. He's got 4,564 yards. He said three of five seasons over 1,000 yards, including a career high last year of 1,205. He's going relatively well. A career high of touchdowns last year of 13, bringing his total to 33. He does receive the ball. I wouldn't say he's a double threat, but he does receive the ball, including a career high last year of 314 yards, bringing his total receiving yards to 1,322. Eight receiving touchdowns. So that's a total of 41 touchdowns, including one in the postseason last year. He's, he's fumbled the ball six times in 66 games. Now that's a strike rate of, uh, what, one in 11? One, in, one every 11 games, something like that. So... You know, it's not as if he never fumbles the ball, but uh, yeah, look, I'm not surprised he's I'm not surprised he's in the top five running backs in a lot of people's um, lists because, you know, I don't know how many running backs over the last five years have have got 4,564 yards. There wouldn't be many. There wouldn't be many. Anyway, that was interesting. The other thing I want to check is his deal. Uh, September 1st, 2020, he signed a four-year, $48 million contract extension with the Bengals through the 2024 season. And he's still currently on that deal. So that is, that's pretty up there for a running back, I must admit. And he's playing as if he's, he's going to double that for his second deal. So uh, with that in mind, let's get into it. An end zone dance with his teammates. The dance that I did, I can't do my like, whoo. That was like a line dance at a wedding. Was it the electric slide? Don't be crazy at the condo. Go crazy on the one two line. Woo. Big step. Big step. Two eight for the Big Bengals. Step. There he is. We can't get satisfied, bro. There he is. Going, I'm trying to turn up some more. There's only more to come. And there's only more to come. Being 26. How did he not get on the list last year? Let me have a look at his stats again. 428. I don't know what happened. Oh, he must have been injured. He was injured. He suffered a foot injury. So only played six games. All right, that makes sense. Played a full 16 last year. First of all, I wanted to say I did franchise this year, and I drafted him on my franchise first round. I'm going to be honest with that. This is balance, for real, for real. Yards out the contact, for real, for real. For real, for real. He's very patient, waiting on his hope. But when he see it, it's kind of like a straight line speed, like, out of there. Man, Joe Mixon turned on the Jets. Fuck yeah. He turned on the... That's a Barry Sanders canter. After Perner's up the sideline. Oh! <laughs> the Jets. He turned on the after Perner's up the sideline. Well, that's not good, is it? Dude, he had a foot injury last season. He could have he quite easily had a neck injury this year. And I'm not joking about that. This is like one of my plays right here on Madden, for real. 
for real, Bill for real. Nixon is the first of the sense templates to make the list. For real, for real. <laughs> Come on, mate. His top 100 day. Don't do him like that. View comes before teammates Joe Burrow and Jamar Chase. Great job, Joe. But I'm trying to make a home run, like 60, 70. You blocking or what? Yeah. On me. Yeah. I'm gonna go with Joe. Joe Mixon or Joe Burrow? Joe Mixon. Mm -hmm. What is that? I think Joe Mixon would make it go. Yes. You already know. The two Joes. The two Joes, that's it. If Brothers. you watch the game, Joe getting a tough six yards, so they ain't never behind the chain. You gotta believe! Well, do all the little things! Man, Joe just cool back there. Cool and calm, just run the football, like out the play. Like, what's up, Joe? Like, what's up? Joe's just different. He's different in general, but it's a good different though. He's one of those dudes that I can't pinpoint what he does best, but he's just a tough tackle for whatever reason. Joe Mixon, he runs hard. And he's Fuck hard yeah, he certainly runs hard. I can see that. Tackle. When you tackle him, even if you know he may fall back, you know, you're still gonna feel it. Okay. There's always one that comes out worse off after an impact like that. That I tell you what, you gotta give you gotta give Matthew fucking credit, mate, for going in like that. Oh my god, let's watch that again. You know, he may fall back, you know, you're still gonna feel it. Oh bruh! That's the big okay, straight up, that is the biggest contact we've seen thus far. Four twenty eight heavens, man. Oh, mate. Yo, Mixon, what DB wants to tackle this guy in the open space? No, thank you. James Pierre, your athletic supporter, is back at about the 35-yard line. In 2020, Mixon missed 10 games on injured reserve. Did you guys see that in step? In 2021, he made up for lost time. Racking up nearly 19. Oh, he's fucking quick. Now, what was it? 4-4 four, four something? It was, wasn't it? 4-4-6? Four, four, Jeez, I can't remember now. 4-4-5. Four, four, and he runs like it. He Majors does. In 20 he's games quick. played. Joe Mixon got injured. And I saw him get injured. And I remember seeing him in the facility, and he just always had this look. He felt like he let his teammates down. And that's how he treated the entire football season. Absolutely. Joe Mixon, you talk about finishing a run. Man, a Shevitz. That's a man that's running with a point to prove. I'm falling for it. Whoever's in my way, we all going for it. Because I have a point to prove to the guys I let down because I got injured. And that's Joe's attitude. That's the attitude of the team. Mixon's going to throw. Touchdown. Just so y'all know. And he can pass. <laughs> <laughs> And he can pass. All right, so he throws touchdowns too. Let's see if they mention that. Come on, mate. What do we got? At least give him the credit. Passing. What do we got? <laughs> postseason. Must have been in the postseason. Completed one. Passing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, one attempt for one completion. Six yards on a touchdown. We're talking wildcat. Would that be right? We're talking wildcat. All right, well, we won't go into his legal issues because you know what? I'm not here for that. I ain't here for that whatsoever. But that was interesting. That was really cool. Joe Mixon, I mean, I've seen you now. I know what you've gone through. And I know you got 1,200 yards last year. And I, I can only say, I can only assume uh, the way that the Bengals are tracking at the moment, you, you'll probably get 1,000 again. So best of luck. And in the next one, we're looking at DeAndre Hopkins, wide receiver for the Cardinals. But he used to play for the Texans. I hope I'm right on that. I'm pretty sure I am. Anyways, guys, thank you and good night.